The Vancouver police are warning the public to be vigilant after receiving at least eight reports of distraction thefts targeting the elderly in the last month. The thefts involve strangers getting out of vehicles and approaching elderly people who are wearing visible jewelry. The thieves are making various excuses to make contact with these people. Some suspects are conversational and very pleasant, while others will appear frantic and be asking for assistance, whether that be for directions or for help. These thieves are very smooth and will get into your personal space very quickly. It's often well after the fact that these guys are gone and the victims realize that the jewelry is. If someone's trying to get into your personal space, take a step back, call the police. So just before five o'clock on uh, May 22nd, a 70 year old Chinese woman uh, was approached in her driveway by two suspects who started to overwhelm her. They immediately approached her and trying to talk to her. English was a second language and they were putting, trying to put rings on her fingers, trying to put a necklace around her neck. She did the right thing, she became uncomfortable. She could feel that they were trying to remove something, a piece of her jewelry. She did push away, but unfortunately the suspects were able to flee they left the area and they did get a piece for a valuable jewelry. Aggressive is not necessarily the right word that I would like to use. I'd like to use overwhelming. It appears to be a technique that they're using. They're coming out there engaging in conversation. So it could, it could start off as being very casual. It could move into uh, an offer to uh, sell jewelry, new jewelry, or blessed jewelry, or those types of things.